In previous video I showed you how to install Linux. So now we will be installing software. It should be working on not only with Ubuntu server but also with other Debian derivatives. So first I'll check if uh, internet is working. Okay, so it's working. So I'll type. So first I need to download the installer. So type again. hqgeneralbytes.com slash uh, releases slash btm install so now I'm downloading the installation script from General Bytes so it's been downloaded I see it here now I will make it executable ATM. So here I see see what commands are, are available to me. So I'll start with init. So now it's asking me for the license number. So I, for demo purposes I have license number 1, 2, 3, but you will certainly have longer one. Now it wants to download additional packages which are required, basically dependencies, which are required by BATM server software. So now, now it wants MySQL password, so I'll set some. So this this uh, password is the root password for to access my SQL server we will need that later on okay great so all the dependencies were installed so we may continue with the command download So let's issue command download. So now it's downloading the actual software. This will take a while. So before before uh, going to configure command, I will just quickly check what is my IP address. So one hundred ninety two one six eight one hundred one one four. Okay. So now 
or it should be configure command password database name so I'll call it BATM database username let's say user password B pass demo now the MySQL root password which was okay and now the public address so I'll use the one which I just saw so one nine two one six eight hundred fourteen okay configuration written and now I will show last command finish so I'm extracting all the files and now I now I have the server installed so I'll issues sudo ATM manage info I can see my uh, my version of the software public IP address and services so I'll start all services okay so now I uh, now I can issue log command. ATM manage has following commands. So I'll take a look on the mass uh, let's say admin service. So I can see that uh, the BATM server admin war was deployed, so it's okay. So now now it's all installed. We will continue with configuring your first terminal through browser.